it has become difficult for the new government to meet even the essential committed expenditure with the reduced revenue of the state. The overall debt has more than doubled in last five years with huge outstanding payments of salaries and pensions, debt repayment for the debt burden of about 10 lakh crore, payments for the power sector dues, civil supplies and other liabilities has become challenging. Putting the governance back on track is truly a Herculean task. My government has already started fulfilling the pre-poll promises and announced that steadfast commitment to super six promises. My government has launched its trademark people-centric governance soon after assuming office with a series of measures such as announcing a mega DSC for filling up 16,347 teacher vacancies, abolishing the Land Titling Act, enhancing social security pensions to rupees 4,000, organizing a skill census, and reopening the Anna canteens to provide food for the poor at every at a very nominal rate of rupees 5 and supply of free sand my government will initiate other important measures also i am sure my government under the able and proven leadership of sri n chandrababu naidu garu the honorable chief minister of andhra pradesh and sri Pawan Kalyan Garu, Honorable Deputy Chief Minister, with complete support of Sri Narendra Modi Garu, Honorable Prime Minister of India, will make all out efforts in fulfilling the aspirations of the people for developing the state. Initiating the process, the Honorable Chief Minister visited New Delhi to meet the Honorable Prime Minister and other union ministers concerned and appraise them of the grim financial situation. During the visit, special requests have also been made to, for hand-holding by the centre and extending liberal support to the state. I appeal to the people of the state to understand the current alarming financial situation and cooperate with the government in rebuilding the state. The massive destruction which resulted in huge loss of natural resource base and human value system really makes the reconstruction process difficult and time-taking one. To assess the complete loss, plan for resource mobilization and development is a cumbersome task. It requires collective thinking, extensive discussions with intelligentsia and academicians to explore ways to overcome the current crisis. It also involves finding ways to restart the entire development ecosystem through short, medium and long-term plans in the light of the new development paradigm of Viksit Bharat at 2047. The extent of real damage done to Andhra Pradesh in the last five years had not come in public discourse thus far. The misgovernance from 2019 to 24 created a trust deficit with regulatory authorities and damaged the brand of AP amongst investors. The people now given a strong mandate to the NDA to rebuild the brand AP and regain the trust. Honorable members, usually winning elections and assuming responsibility is a happy event. But now we are meeting in different and difficult circumstances. Perhaps for the first time in the country, the members are not in a position to rejoice and have the means to meet people's aspirations immediately. Keeping this in view, my government is proposing to go for budget after meaningful deliberations.